Welcome to this video where we delve into the fascinating world of bilateral migration and remittances, exploring these trades from a global perspective. For this analysis, I utilize two valuable datasets. One from the UN provides bilateral migration data spanning 1990 to 2020 in five year increments. The other from NOMAD offers insights specific to 2021. Our focus will be on 174 countries with complete data for both migration flows and remittance patterns and compassing both origin and destination points. We will begin by examining a global snapshot of bilateral migration and remittances as of 2020 and 2021. Interestingly, the United States emerges as a top destination for migrants from 43 countries. Similarly, 45 nations identify the U.S. as their primary source of remittances. Russia and India hold significant positions, with the 12 of and 10 countries respectively reporting them as leading sources of migrants. When it comes to remittance targets, France, China, and India take the top spots. This global overview compels us to ask a crucial question. What factors make the U.S. such a magnet for migrants? By understanding these pool factors, can we develop our own countries to retain talents, harnessing the immense potential of our human capital and potentially reducing outward migration? Let's delve deeper and explore some key observations on a country-by-country -country basis. A striking trend is disproportionate number of Al Algerians migrating to France, while the opposite holds true for migrants from Western Sahara. While India remains a major source of migrants for Bangladesh, its share is declining in favor of Saudi Arabia and United Arab Emirates. Costa Rica exhibits a clear preference for the U.S. as a migrant destination, while the majority of migrants within the country originate from Nicaragua. Canada represents a dynamic situation. Though the U.S. remains a popular destination, a rising trade is observed with migrants from India, China, and Philippines. Conversely, mig migration from traditional sources like the UK, USA, and Italy is on the decline. Political instability plays a role. As instability grips Congo, the number of migrants living for Burundi has risen, while a more peaceful Rwanda sees a decrease in outward migration. A sharp rise is evident in Venezuelan migration to Brazil and Ecuador. A fascinating pattern emerges between Burkina Faso and Cote d'Ivoire. A significant portion of Burkinabes migrate to Cote d'Ivoire and vice versa. This trade is mirrored in remittance flows as well. Several countries stand out for their unique migration and remittance patterns. These include Dominican Republic, El Salvador, France, Kenya, Mexico, Netherlands, Saudi Arabia, Ukraine, USA, Vietnam. In this video, we have explored the intricate tapestry of global bilateral migration and remittance flows. Join us in the next video where we will embark on a journey to understand global terrorism.